Howdy, y'all. It's Evan here down in chicken country. Here at Brandon. <laughs> you know what he said? He said talk. That's how I'm going to normally talk. <laughs> Three, two. <laughs> Abby's gonna watch this and be like, oh yeah, blooper reel, perfect. The John Bell, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Went back right to the beginning. And it has playgrounds for different ages, disc golfing and a bunch of trails and a pavilion you can use. So for, a no mm. so we also have, hold on, I need to collect my thoughts. That was my little tidbit and now I have to think of my next one. Hi, my name is Kenneth Horowitz. I'm an historical interpreter here at Delaware Seashore State Park. And, oh, I lost my train of thought already. <laughs> and during the COVID-19 pandemic, we had a little bit of, I, I, don't, I can't do this. <laughs> I don't want to do it. I hate this. And today we're going to learn a little bit more. Ooh, Lord. Oh, Sorry, that girl. That was really good. Ah. In 1777, however, the war was not... That one was too much. I'm sorry. I'll just start that section again. Is he riding a lawnmower? Or like Please feel free, stop by, wave me down, be sure to say hi, and hopefully I can get you some hands-on. Um, uh, hopefully I can get, let me start over on that one. <laughs> Evan Williams at Brandywine Park. That's pretty good. Yeah. Wait, hang on. Stop, move this way a little bit. Thought. Help us be a part of making this a good recreational amenity for years to come. I am just not finding my words today. That reflects the second century, the 1800s. I screwed that one up. I'm sorry. So the way that we identify English ivy as to opposed to all other ivies is the white veins that grow. Shoot, sorry, hold on. <laughs> I messed up. And I assume that uh, Jane is milk. You can start with that sentence, I assume that. And I assume that Jane Smith uh, felt the same way in terms of his life. And I assume that Jay Anderson Smith felt the same way when he came to his wife. Visit us at Trap Pond Partners. Okay, I think I'm done. Am I done? I know. <laughs> a, 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 this is my problem. All right. Sorry, I'm gonna do that one again. No recording. Nope. <laughs> That's all right. Sorry. I don't even remember what I said. Oh, I could do it. During the 1920s, uh, this is when... Cut it, cut it, and I lost two. my part. Um, we should enjoy nature uh, in the short increments that we can. Granted, you know... I'm sorry! You were doing great! Ah, I didn't know I'm, I'm, I'm lying! <laughs> Which is essentially meaning that we tried to save every piece of... Every piece of... I'm so sorry. I'm gonna try that one again. A lot of more native plants will grow in um, alternate leaves, where it's one, 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 one. So that is, ah, I lost it, I'm sorry. <laughs> can come here and uh, fish. We are the high, highest stock. I can't do this. <laughs> and replace it and then go back to shoulder arms. Um, <sighs> sorry. Just had a brain fart. This station behind me was built in 1786. Or excuse me. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm getting my dates mixed up. Shipwreck happened 1785. This is built 1876. There we go. His familiarity with Elizabeth Patel's tavern, when a location was wanted for to host the... Sorry. Yep. <clears throat> Hi, my name is Evan. I'm the lead national of Brandywine Park, and right now, and so I'm going to say, "Take two." 